Greetings ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy 6. In the last episode, we obtained the Odin slash Raiden Esper from the Ancient Castle, uh, which teaches us quick and strength plus 2, which is pretty nice. In between episodes, I did do a little bit of uh, fighting with the Curse Shield equipped. It is still the Curse Shield, I probably, uh, I don't know how far I've got, honestly, I've lost track, but I didn't want to, I mean it's 255 battles you have to do. It takes a while, and I just wanted to play a bit more of the game, uh, but I've still kept the party that I was grinding with just so I could show you spells that I got. I was just uh, grinding on the belt so I don't gain experience. Terra's pretty far with Ultima. Uh, she has all the tier 3s. I don't know if she had that before, but yeah, she was mainly just working on Ultima. Um, she has Quick as well now, so I got her those. Salas has pretty much got everything. At this point, she has re-raise. Uh, she's only missing Thundaga. Uh, she has Ultima. She has Staga and Sloga. She has Bala and Quick. Like she's, uh, she's pretty stacked in magic. Realm's got re-raise, and she just—I think she's yeah. She's got all the tier threes. She just needs to get Ultima. She's currently pretty close on Quick. She has Bala as well, and then Strago. I still need to work on re-raise with him, and yeah, a lot of the offensive spells, but I did get him Ultima, so Strago has Ultima now, and he has her Staga, and he's currently working on Quick with Raiden. Um, but I'm going to be changing up my party for this uh, next area that we're going to be going to in, my, uh, in this, and I didn't mean to do that. I actually want to change my party up. Um... We have to bring Strago and Realm for this, so that's pretty mandatory. Uh, I'm gonna actually bring, I'm gonna bring Locke, and I'm gonna bring Sabin. We haven't had Sabin in this team for quite a while. So with that in mind, uh, let me just go unequip those currently not in my party, and all that jazz. Strago and Realm can stay on the Espers that they're currently on. Um, do I want Locke to learn Ragnarok? kind of want him to... Uh, yeah, Hestarga would be nice. You honestly don't matter. As long as you get magic buffs on upon level up. So with that in mind, I'm probably just going to stick Valagamander on you while no one else is using it. In terms of levels, yeah, you're pretty close, so it's a watch lock as well. Um, let's equipment go. Yeah, the Valiant Knife, of course. Um, Reed Cloak. I must have got that by accident when grinding, because I didn't realize I had that. <laughs> uh, Tiger Fang for sure. Give him a Flame Shield, a Red Cap. Gives a nice most MP and the red jacket, which can only be. Uh... Oh wow! So I can actually, because this negates fire damage. Yeah, this can only be worn by Edgar or Saban. I can give him the red jacket, which negates fire, and then I can give him a thunder shield, which uh, absorbs thunder. So that's really good. It's really a combo. Uh, yeah. For this, you are getting master scroll. And I guess a ribbon, and then honestly, like, probably just gonna give you two heroes rings for that flexibility. Don't know if your level is averaged out and you've gained any more blitzes. Now we have Razor Gale, which is the one I can never input properly. Up, up, right, right, down, down, left. Uh, it's just too long. I'll just, I'll still be sticking to Aura Cannon, Rising Phoenix, Chakra. If necessary. Um, I'm also gonna now give Strago a gold hairpin because I have two. So now you both have them. And yeah, we're good to go, finally. So yeah, sorry about that. I just wanted to show off what I did in between episodes and all the spells that I was getting and whatnot. So now we're gonna take the wheel and we're gonna go ahead to Thamasa. Just all the way down here, I believe. Do, 
do do Yep. Down on this island. Right here. Oh no, it's this one. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. So, yeah, there we go. We're home! So, yeah, you actually have to bring Realm and Strago for this, so this would not uh, trigger if you hadn't recruited both of them yet. I believe, anyway. Grandpa! You gotta come quick! Gungo's hurt! Who's Gungo? <laughs> Gungo? Gungo? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hang in there. Who is this Gungo? It was Hedon, that legendary beast you and I used to hunt. Almost had him too. Hedon? Ooh, cough, cough, cough. <laughs> I wonder why he's coughing. Please avenge me! So this is like Strago's old friend. He's just been slayed by this Hedon guy. Grandpa, what are you standing around for? Let me go kick this bitch's ass. Grow old and stop thinking about pursuing the dreams of my youth. Oh, I'm going after him. So yeah, we're gonna go after a monster. And this monster's actually gonna be helpful because it's actually able to teach uh, Striker one of the best laws in the game. Debatably. Let's get the best of it. It's a matter of pride, dear. It's a matter of you being a stubborn old man. You're my grandpa. You can't just sit and watch while you make things harder for yourself than they have to be. Bum, bum, bum. Sorry, Realm. It means a lot to me that you care so much. But he knows a tough beast to, tr to crack. Its name comes from the old word for hidden, after all. I'll ever find him if I don't go. To Ebbets Rock. Phew. <laughs> so we gotta go to Ebbets Rock, which is actually located just right north of uh, the Massa. That just came from me in my dreams. So that's a hint about Doma Castle. We're actually gonna be doing that in the next episode. Well, depending on how long this takes. I don't think this will take too long, but yeah. People have been hinting about Doma Castle giving people dreams. Uh, we've already visited the shops here, I believe. Yeah, but yeah, this is nothing new. Do you sell shurikens? Yes, you do. You actually sell Fuma shurikens as well. They are kind of pricey, but I actually. I'll buy 30 of them. Oh, they're actually not that expensive, you know. Boom. Yeah, I got a lot of my money back from... Obviously, we had to spend a lot of money uh, to get the uh, Gilgamesh Esper. But I've been, I've been getting quite a bit of it back from the vault. Alright, so let's just make a quick save. Probably should have healed Sabin. Don't know why he's so damaged. I uh, forget, high potions only heal 250 in this game. I don't really care about his MP, because I'm not casting spells with him. Yeah, Ebbets Rock is literally this cave right here. So let's go. Oh. It's going to be one of these, eh? Oh. I'm hungry! The chest talks! Hungry, hungry, hungry. <laughs> Give me something to eat, or I won't let you through. I love me some coral. You got any on you? Feed the chest some coral? I don't have any coral, I'm afraid. Skin flint, get out of here. So, we have to go find some coral for this chest, otherwise he won't let us pass. How we find that coral? guess from uh, exploring around this little area here. Now, I don't know if this still applies, but when I was reading the guide for this area, 
It said that in the original game, because it was a guide for the original game, like the SNES version, um, you had to have 22 pieces of coral, otherwise he won't let you through, and the game doesn't actually tell you that. I don't know if that still applies in this version, but to be safe, I am going to uh, rack up 22 pieces of coral before I give him any. How do we get out of here? Okay, that's six. This this area is so random. I don't know what's going on in this goddamn place. At least the enemies are pretty easy. For the most part. Oh, yeah. Gotta get used to blitzing again. Yeah, like the enemies are dying really fast, so... Probably could have come here a while ago. Oh. So I've just got to wander around until I get more coral. That's basically the gist of what's going on. The layout of the cave, I, I don't even know, to be honest. See, look, we're back at him now. I don't want to feed you any coral yet, because you might just take it, and then I have to go back to square one and get 22 more. Seven. Like, it seems to just be one room that just repeats. Oh, hi. You're very undead looking. <laughs> yep. Basically, <laughs> getting a lot. We, they drop a lot of teleport zones. Maybe a hint is if, like, if you want to get the fuck out of here, you can. Okay, this is new. That's. Uh, maths is hard. 13. No, 12. <laughs> We've got 12. Don't, don't ask me why it's 22. I, I really don't know. Really, really don't know. Yeah, and he's a very weak. Realm learn quick. Yay. Now I'm gonna give her Ragnarok. So yeah, probably shouldn't have left this so late, but it is what it is. So here, any chests? Give me a chest. Please! That would be grand. Couldn't steal. Shooks. I mean, these guys are easy magic points, so. Can't complain. Yeah, this is just. What is going on right now? Okay, that is. We're on 12, right? 17. 17. Is that the exit? That's what you just put as it the exit. I don't want to leave. I ain't backing out. Who do you think I am? What do you take me for? Ha! Oh, that sucked. Warlock dude has a lot of magic defense. Yo.
young lock gained a level. Huh, <laughs> 20 experience away. I need two more. Just two more game. Oh, God damn, I can't get through there. Yeah, you just have to wander around aimlessly, it seems. And that's how you uh, pick up coral, because this dungeon just seems completely random. This is what it looks like to me. Five! Right. Where's that fucking treasure box? No, I don't need any more. Take me back. Ha! Let me some coral. Yes, we'll feed you some goddamn coral. Munch. Munch, 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 munch. Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Corpulence is happiness. Now I'm stuffed. Uh. <laughs> Yeah, let us through. Shouldn't have ate so much. Mother, this motherfucker. That's Hedon. Oh crap. Uh, I mean, I don't know anything about this fight. I don't know if it's gonna be scary or not. I doubt it's going to be tough, right? I mean, the enemies in here aren't that particularly bad. Oh, well, there's like four little things. Let's steal from the big one. A teleport stone. God damn it. Yeah, mighty god. And... Saga. Okay. Just like the tentacle things from earlier, they all seem to have different elemental weaknesses. And that stinks. You can fucking put. Yeah, boy. Alright, so. Hmm. Non elemental stuff would be preferable. What just happened? Oh, frickin', he's a freaking zombie. Bastard. It's because I don't have a ribbon on him. Well, oh, you don't have fucking Ultima. I was gonna say, when, you need, when you're in need of null elemental attacks, It's just the one at the back. Oh god damn it, that's gonna kill saving. I didn't fucking heal him. Oh no, I didn't. Uh, yeah, can we white wind please? Stop! Well, you know what? I don't even care. I need Ultima on her now. <laughs> okay, that bitch at the back just absorbs everything, it looks like. I need Strago to cast Ultima. Ha! Oh, can we stop with the poison? Oh, he's dead. Yay! Yep, that was pretty easy. Six magic points. And another fucking teleport stone. <laughs> oh, you guys, I just fucked up really. You know what I didn't do? The whole point of doing this was so I could learn the fucking blue magic. I didn't learn the blue magic. 
Shit! <laughs> Fuck! Yeah, you've got to wait long enough for him to actually use it. Shit, okay. I'll be right back. Oh, god damn it. Okay, round two. This time, I actually need to wait for him to fucking use Grand Train. Which is the lore we actually need to learn. And the whole point of his being here. So, yeah. I didn't actually steal from the little ones last time, so I'm gonna do that now. Yeah, I just need to hold off. Okay, they have no items. I need to just hold off attacking the main dude until he uses Grand Train. Which is what I wanna learn. So I can kill these fuckers, I believe, anyway. So I don't wanna attack with Log because he's gonna fucking. He is going to attack Edon. I mean, I can afford to attack him a little bit, but... I just need to make sure... He freaking does his thing. So... This one on the back just seems to absorb anything I can freaking throw at him. Damn it. And it has Reflect now, apparently. I'm just gonna have Sabin attack it. <laughs> you know what? I'm gonna put Sabin in the front row. Okay, can we not with the poison, please? Kill this one. Dead. Nice. This guy's just gonna keep casting bio. I'm just gonna throw a cure on. I don't know how long it takes him to actually use the attack. I really hope he doesn't need his little minions to be alive in order to do it. Okay, that's dead. Now we wait. Oh. Grand Delta. I imagine that's what it is. Did he not learn that? Is that not it? I didn't see a... Uh... Oh no, because he doesn't. it doesn't pop up. I'm gonna assume that's what it was, right? That has to be what it was. I forget it doesn't actually appear in mid-battle that you've learned it. <coughs> Excuse me. I hope that was it. I mean, I know it's called Grand Train in the original, so Grand Delta is more than likely going to be the spell. If not, then that's just fucking bullshit. <laughs> yeah, this guy, this guy's toast. If you really want to avoid the poison, and then like equip yourselves with appropriate relics, but other than that, very easy fight. Uh, learn Grand Delta. There we go. That's the whole point of doing this. Is what we needed. Although, Strago has Ultimo. I really doubt I'm ever going to use it. Tell Gungo he's been avenged. Okay, thankfully he gets us out of the cave. Even though we had plenty of teleport stones to get us out. But that's all good. Gungo! Oh no, is he gonna, he's going he's gonna to be dead, isn't he? Oh no, he's alive. Shit. Can an injured man get some rest? I defeated Hedon. You what? You beat Hedon, you're lying. No, he's not. He really did it. Ho ho ho. Well, a little monster like Hedon could hardly expect to stand up to the likes of me. Can't believe it, but it looks like I have to concede defeats you show me up on, man. Yeah, we did. Yeah, you should probably get back into bed and stop jumping around, pal.
that evening. <laughs> huh. So there I was, creeping through the caves that seemed to go on forever. I finally reached the deepest, darkest cavern, and there it is, right in front of me. I stared the ugly brute straight in the eyes, raised my staff, and let him have it. Bam! Thwack! Pow! Right in the kisser. I mean, yeah, to be fair, Strago did bop him with Ultima a few times. <laughs> awesome moments again. Where's Grandpa? Hmm? I think he finally tied himself out from all that jabbering and nodded off. Do you think it's okay to leave like this, with him thinking I was really hurt? Don't worry about it. If we hadn't tricked him, he just spent the rest of his life doing nothing but talk. Ah! It was a prank, bro. They pranked him. So he would go after the beast. The epic troll. <laughs> ah. Damn. He's not the wisest, wise old man. <laughs> Alright, so that concludes that side quest. Can't believe we're not fucking field game. Did we not sleep overnight? Anyway. Law. Oh, fucking hell. Buttons are hard. Grand Delta. Create a triangular energy field that deals massive damage to all enemies. I believe it's massive, yeah, it's just non-elemental damage, but the thing is, this exists. And it's only like 8 more MP cost. There is no reason for me to use it, but I mean, it, it's there for, for sure. I, I'm sure it could be good, maybe. But, uh, yeah. Currently, would have been way better to get that earlier, but the thing is, like... I mean, you get, yeah, you could have got Strago way earlier, I guess. I'm actually gonna just rest at the end. Boo doo doo. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, one guild per night still. Absolutely fabulous. Ugh, excuse me. Alright, well. Even though that didn't take too long, I think I'm going to end this episode about here. In the next episode, we're actually going to be heading to the final area, the final little side quest that we need to do before we're going to head back to the godforsaken cultist tower. But I think I am way more prepared now than I was before to do that. But uh, yeah, we're going to be doing the one final thing, which is going to be to go to Doma Castle. We're going to be forced to do Cyan, which is going to be a chore. But <laughs> And uh, yeah. I will see you in the next one. Be sure to subscribe. See you later.